all right friends so we are going to cover how to renew an existing exchange certificate in exchange 2019 so this is the exchange server and this is the certificate that is about to expire in next 90 days so first of all I'm going to just create a, a shared folder in here because we will need it when we will uh, create the CSR so I'm just going to name it CSR for now and because this is a temporary share that uh, I'm creating so for now I'm going to uh, share it with everyone for now but this is not a good practice so as I said it is temporary so I'm going to set everyone read write rights <coughs> and share so this is going to be our path so I'm just going to make a note of it all right and let's see if it works yeah it works so now go back to the ECP exchange control panel and select the certificate click on renew and here it is going to ask you for the UNC path so I'm going to put the UNC path here name the file something which makes sense to you and then click on OK now you will see that we do have a pending request here and we also have a CSR file here so now we are going to process this and get this certificate so I have processed the CSR and now we are going to complete the request so I'm in the server and I clicked on the pending request now I'm going to click on complete and then we are going to put the UNC path where we have saved the certificate so this is my UNC path now I will click on OK and let it finish alright so this is now set up and as you can see it is right now set up for IMAP and POP but we want to use it for Outlook Web Access as well as for uh, uh, Outlook Auto Discovery so I'm going to click on add it and then I'm going to select the rest of the services as well from here so IIS and SMTP and then I'm going to click on save so it is going to override the existing default SMTP certificate so we we are going to hit yes so that it would replace the old certificate with the new certificate after completing setting up the certificate we are now going to test to make sure the certificate is properly installed so I am going to access the site and then I'm going to check the certificate on the site so hit on the pad icon here and then click on certificate now as you can see the certificate is updated and it is showing a date from December 2021 and uh, today it's November 20 uh, so we have renewed it for a year and it is properly showing up in here so this is it thank you